All right, throwing the trash, aluminum cans, big plastic air container, half and half container. I think that all should go in there. That looks like what we would what we would put in like the yellow bag. Well, not, we don't have a yellow bag here, but uh, all right, Mocha, I think I've got the trash all sorted. Um, I've got my metals and plastics, got my papers, I've got my refuse, um, got everything packed up and ready to go. So we've been back in the United States for a week now and uh, Mocha and I are doing okay. Um, we gotta go to the trash. Wanna make sure we put everything in the right place. So, you know, alles in Ordnung or everything according to the rules um, because we wanna make a good impression on our neighbors here in the US, our first week back living here. And uh, yeah, so let's go to the trash point and find out how everything works here. All right, let's go. All right, here's the trash point. Mm, that's weird. There's only one container. Uh, how can that be? See, I've got my cardboard here. I mean, I got... Why do they give you so many bags at the grocery store here? Look at all these free bags. All this paper, what am I supposed to do with that? I don't know, anyway. Um, okay, so I'm guessing this is for the refuse. So I'll put this in here. Um, I don't know about my plastic, what am I, what am I gonna do? Um, Excuse me, uh, excuse me, ma'am. Uh, can can you tell me where I put my cardboard and and my paper and my plastic? This just seems to be like it's for the regular refuse. In the trash can, where it goes. Right here. Yes. What? That's kind of sign. What? The the paper goes in here. Yes. And the refuse. Yes. And the plastics. Of course. Where else would you put it? You don't have a recycle container, a recycle system here? Huh? A reuse? What? And what about my what about my fund or what about my deposit bottles? Where do they go? What are you talking about? You know, you buy bottles and you put a deposit on it and you get money back when you take them. Where are you from? No. You just put it in the trash. Oh, uh, okay. Um Okay. Well, I guess. Um, oh. This actually this actually hurts a little bit throwing away throwing away this paper. Oh. Yeah, that's where it goes. Ah. Just oh, it doesn't feel right. Oh. This You can put the whole bag in there. Oh, look at this American size milk container uh, one and a half gallons it goes in here too yes oh. you don't have cardboard recycle no do you see anything oh no please forgive me That's it. I feel guilty about putting all that metal and paper and cardboard and plastic in one bin, but I guess that's how they do it here. Hello everyone, and how you doing? Welcome to our apartment here in the United States. I wanna talk about recycling, uh, trash day, Mulltrennung, the rubbish. Uh, this topic is one of the biggest culture shocks for Americans moving to Germany and one of the biggest reverse culture shocks of Americans moving back to the United States from Germany, especially depending on the region of the United States you might be moving to or from, um, uh, coming from or going to Germany. Um, and to be honest, when you first move to Germany from the U.S., 
from my experience, and I, it's all it's going to be different depending on the region of the country you're from. But from my experience, it's a little bit frightening, a little bit scary. The the seriousness uh, that the Germans take in recycling their trash and separating their trash into into different areas. So. Um, it's a little bit different in Germany depending on the region you're moving to. Sometimes it's different from city to city, town to town, uh, that might be just a few kilometers apart. But in general, there's some basic rules and uh, typically the rules are stuff like plastics, like yogurt containers, um, aluminum cans or tin cans, um, plastic bags, paper and cardboard of course. All of that stuff in general is always going to be separated into different containers and then you're going to take it and either it gets picked up from your house or your apartment or um, you have to take it to a recycling center uh, in, in those different um, categories. Now, um, and also there's the, 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 the category of bottles, uh, buying stuff in a, in a plastic bottle or in a glass bottle and normally or oftentimes you're going to pay a deposit or what the Germans call a fond on those and so you take those back uh, to the store and uh, after you use them you get money back based on the deposit you used and those things are taken and then I, I guess they're cleaned and reused at a, at a, at a different point. Now in America it's vastly different. Uh, I'm sure you know America is a really big country and depending on where you go the uh, rules for trash may be vastly different. Um, so in the US you may have a recycling system where you live at. Um, if you do, it oftentimes it's only voluntary so if you don't want to use the recycling system you don't have to. You can always, typically you can always put your stuff into one big bin and it all goes away at the, together um, if you don't want to separate your stuff um, so you can do that normally. Uh, sometimes it's required to separate your stuff in different categories like maybe there's paper, um, maybe there's glass, but that's typically about it and in some places there's absolutely no uh, trash separation or recycling system whatsoever so everything goes into one big bin and it all goes away to the same place and I, I guess it's burned or whatever they do with it, right? I really, I really don't know. Now, personally, after living in Germany for several years and being a very diligent trash separator and a very diligent recycler, uh, when I came back to the United States in this particular region, it's not, they're not very strict on recycling. It seems to be kind of a voluntary effort. And in some places where you go to throw your trash away, like you saw my little skit, uh, there's just one bin. And after living in Germany for several years, I gotta be honest, I feel a little bit guilty um, not separating and not recycling my plastics, my metals, my papers. Uh, yeah, I feel a little guilty. I'm like, oh, this, this can't be right. I'm killing the earth. That's bad for the environment. So anyway, yeah, um, I don't know. But uh, it, things seem to be changing in the U.S. More and more areas seem to be uh, uh, adopting uh, recycling systems, trash separating systems. Um, I don't really know if um, they're really doing anything with the trash they, when they separate it. I, you know, you hear people, some people complain like, oh, that all goes to the same place anyway. They just make it sort it, uh, government control or whatever you want to call it. And even some Germans will say that too. So I, honestly, I don't really know. Maybe I can do some research and find out what happens to our trash after it gets uh, sorted and taken to the, um, the, the trash bin or the recycle area. But anyway, I wanted to share that with you, do a little skit on kind of how it goes because that is a huge culture shock, shock or a reverse culture shock for Americans going to or coming from Germany. So hope you enjoyed that little skit. Hope it was informative to you and uh, share your comments on what you think about the recycle system in Germany or in the US and uh, let us know who you think has a, a better system and how long it took you to adopt to the system in a new country. Thanks for watching. Give us a thumbs up and share your comments and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more culture shock videos and more travel videos throughout the United States and throughout Europe. Thanks for watching.